Hey guys, today we are going to talk about nine kind of strange, but not really that strange, cards that have gone up in price. We will start with a card from the dark. Wow. I really didn't expect the dark. The dark has been on a move recently with the Mana Vortex and now the Martyr's Cry. I, ha I have loved the dark. I didn't know this card existed. I had to go out and find them. Do I believe $7.50 is the actual price from like 10 cents? No, but it's actually not a bad card. So it's double white. All white creatures are removed from the game. Players must draw one card for each white creature they control that is lost in this manner. For two white. It's not bad. It's actually very good against a white deck if you don't. If your opponent's playing creatures and you don't play any creatures, it's fantastic in EDH. I don't know, it's it's actually good. I do not remember this card at all. But I look at it and I say, huh. Another card that was under a dollar, maybe under 75 cents, was the Void Mage Prodigy. This is clearly due to a wizard deck being in Commander 2017. Now, all the decks look very good in my opinion. I'm going to personally buy one of each, sleeve them up, and leave them as is. And whenever a friend comes over, we can pull out the decks and play with them. Overall, very, very good card. I like it. I think it's one of the better wizards. And it needs to sacrifice wizards, which is fine because now you have an entire deck of them to sacrifice. In the past, the reason that it wasn't played or not and was not valuable was there wasn't enough wizards to make an EDH deck. Now there's an entire Commander 2017 with new ones and very strong ones to boot. So this one makes a lot of sense to me, but it is still strange seeing it from 75 cents I just always figured it would always be 75 cents. Now, cards in the move I include pretty much everything from Arabian Nights, like every card. Uh, this is meh at best. I think it's free and a green. Is that? Or is it one? I think it's four total, yeah. Tap to reduce an attacking creature's power to zero. It's a zero free. I'm pretty sure this is on the reserve list because a lot of Arabian Nights, especially the rares, are, and this is a rare. And it is 85 bucks now from the, I'm going to say $20 price point it recently was at. You are just not going to see these very cheap Arabian Nights cards any longer. Uh, these things have just been trending up the entire time. I don't see that being different. Arabian Nights is one set. The Dark is another. Uh, as you will see from the next two cards, Legends has been trending up as well. And it's not just the good cards, right? The good cards are trending up, but not as much as a percentage as the met cards, right? The cards that are... Essentially, it's the bulk rares of the set. They are spiking like crazy. All right, Knowledge Vault. It's... Not great. It's four, two, tap it, take a card from the library without looking at it, and place it under, face down, under Knowledge Vault. Sacrifice Knowledge Vault to discard entire hand, and then take the cards under the vault into your hand. If Knowledge Vault leaves a play, put all cards under it in your graveyard. I don't believe there's a combo. I'm not, I cannot imagine how this card would be good. You have so much better card draw I mean you're paying four and then you're paying two and then you have to discard your hand eventually and if they in if they throw instant speed artifact removal you're kind of screwed so I don't know I mean it's just an old these things are being collector's items they're collector's items there's no other way I can say it. this card's not playable now this card it's friends playable like when I mean fringe playable, I mean like the out outlier, right? Mana Matrix, and it has been spiking. This is not the first time it spiked, but it is $70 right now. Wow, I, I look at it and say to myself, hmm. 
six mana to do what? Pay up to two less than required whenever casting an instant interrupt or enchantment spell. Yeah, there's a card called So Ring, and it pretty much does this for one. And it doesn't have limitations. This costs six. I really cannot see... Uh, I can't see... I mean, you would have to p play free spells to break even, and even then you lost a card. Right? So... Uh, it's just not, not good. It's not good. But it is now a $70 card. What is the common theme? It is a rare from Legends on the reserve list. There you go. Now, Steely Resolve, I remember this card from back in the day. It was okay. It wasn't the best, but I did play it in my elf deck. It is now $6.83 and trending up. I am just shocked this card has not been reprinted. That's kind of why it's on this list, because I looked at the price and I was like, wow, this is very expensive for this card. Now, yes, it makes sure that you come and play, you choose a creature type, so it's not all your creatures. You have to play a tribal deck, which makes sense now, because Wizards is pushing tribal in 2017. Creatures of the chosen type can't be the target of spells or abilities, but this, as the enchantment, can. Like, how should I say, like, enchantment removal is plentiful. And artifact removal is plentiful. Creature removal is plentiful. I just don't see... The problem with this card is instead of, like, put playing another elf or whatever you want to play, maybe a cat, you're spending your time trying to protect them, which is very non-aggressive. All right, so let's talk about this card. I had no idea why this card is $16.54 right now. I get it. It's very good. Um, your life total can't change, and you have protection from everything, and all permits you control phase out. I'm, I suspect what you're going to do is you're going to board wipe, then you're going to play this, and you're going to protect yourself from board wipe. Since, or you can Armageddon and protect yourself from Armageddon. But that's assuming every opponent taps out. At least in my play group, everyone is playing some type of blue and they're, they got the mana leaks, the counter spells, the mana drains, the force of wills. And everyone's just trying to get off a combo. Uh, I like this card a lot. I think it's very unique. Uh, I'm not sure how best to use it. Is it worth $16? No. No card in Command 2017 is worth $16, right? It's just a given. It's, it's just a given. Now, here's a card that I had mentioned previously that I said that you should buy. Empress Galena. It's always been good. Always been good. The foil is $75. $75. What the, I mean, I played during Invasion, that was, I believe, in middle school. I want to say, like, seventh grade, Invasion came out for me, and Invasion was very good. We didn't know better. One of my friends, he wanted to play the Coalition Victory deck. Terrible deck. But I used to play the, what what was that deck? Um, Nimble Mongoose deck, like, Green Aggro, <laughs> Green Aggro. But it was a good time, and I knew this card would be very good in EDH. I just didn't know that it would be a $75 foil. Back then, foils were not considered very good. Because foils, if you had one... Because you didn't have an entire foil deck, you couldn't afford it. But it kind of... People suspected you of cheating if you kept drawing the right foil. And Brimaz. King Kitty is up again. He's thirteen fifty from his... I'm going to guess $8 low, maybe 7 So that's not bad. He almost doubled in price. He is going to continue to go up in price. I This is not the last time I'm going to make a video of King Kitty because he makes Kitty tokens. That's very, very important. There's not that many cats that make cat tokens. And out of the cats that make them, he's very quick. He's a free 4 
He has a vigilance. He's a legendary creature, which doesn't affect him in EDH only positively. King Kitty is the real deal. Uh, he never saw much play in Standard, unfortunately, when he was in Standard. But that was because, you know, Mono Black was like very good. Pack Rats and Thought Seas and <laughs> Underworld Connections. Never got his uh, turn to shine because White was just not strong enough. Anyway, that is it. Uh, leave me a comment below. Bye, guys.